Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and a warm welcome, welcome if you're new, honey. Today I heard some really tragic news about the Beverly Hills 90210 star, Joe E. Tata, the guy who played the Peach Pit owner, Nat. Um, he was found dead at 85. So if you're ready to get into this story and find out what happened, just stay tuned. The actor who played the owner of the Peach Pit on Beverly Hills 90210, the gathering spot where Brandon, Brenda, Dylan, Kelly, and the rest of the high schoolers met, has officially died. It looks like he's been suffering from Alzheimer's since 2014, and over time, that has taken a toll on him. Joe's fellow castmate, Ian Ziering, posted his remembrance, and I quote, Joey was truly an OG. I remember seeing him on the Rockford Files with James Garner years before we worked together on 90210. He was often one of the background villains in the original Batman series. Huh, I didn't know that. One of the happiest people I've ever worked with, he was as generous with his wisdom as he was with his kindness. In total, Joe was in 238 episodes of 90210. He also appeared occasionally on the reboot of the show as well. As for his other credits, he was on Magnum P.I., The Rockford Files, Hill Street Blues, The A-Team, and today years old, I just found out that he was also on Batman, which now that I think about it, his face is definitely familiar. Like, I think I remember him seeing him on Batman, but I just never really realized it was him. But he did pass away at 85 guys so the silver lining of this i will say is that at least he reached age 85 that's a very long life that's a very full life you know it sounds like um like you know we all have to go at some point but this doesn't really sound like the the crazy ones like i actually just did a story about someone who passed away they got run over guys and they got stuck in the tire part yeah that's a that's one way that I don't think anybody on this green earth wants to go out like okay because that was just ridiculous this you know he was just he was found deceased I'm pretty sure he just passed in his sleep you know so there is a silver lining here my prayers are still going to go up to his friends and family as well because whether or not the way that they passed them still passing is definitely a loss and it's definitely a grievance so my condolences but yeah guys if you have any extra information that you want to add any new updates anything that i didn't mention feel free to leave it in the comments and if you made it this far make sure you like subscribe and hit that bell that way you're notified every time i post and in the meantime guys please be careful out here and hold on to your loved ones when you see them hug them okay because you never know like you never know what tomorrow may bring so all right love you bye